Hello YouTubers and welcome to Novus Talks with me your host Novus Gorgas. And as you can tell in this video we're going to be reacting to the Nintendo Direct that's currently going on for Animal Crossing. This was announced on Tuesday and it's starting pretty much in like another two minutes. So uh, I'm gonna open that up and get straight into that. Um, like I said before, I've never played Animal Crossing, never had any real experience with it, so um, my reaction to this direct isn't really going to be anything special, we'll say, but um, I had nothing else really to do, and I was like, well, what better thing to do than react to the only Nintendo Direct we've gotten in nearly a year, pretty much. So, um, yeah, I think it starts in like two minutes. Uh, it's obviously, since I've never played any Animal Crossing game or anything like that, I've no idea what to expect or what I should be hoping to see, but um, I'm willing to just let it play out and uh, hope that, uh, I don't know, maybe I'll see something that's appealing. Uh, so yeah, this was announced Tuesday. Um, we all kind of knew there was an Animal Crossing Nintendo Direct coming, but... <clears throat> It just still seemed like a bit of a shock because there was that rumor that we were getting two directs during the month. Uh, I didn't fully believe it, but uh, some people thought we were. Um, obviously, it didn't turn out to be the case, and we're just getting Animal Crossing for now. So it starts about in a minute, I believe, even though the, the live stream started nearly half an hour ago. Um, I'm checking the chat because I keep posting uh, how long to go. So, one minute, and uh, yeah, that's why I might seem a bit like I have nothing to say because I have no experience with Animal Crossing. It was never a franchise that's appealed to me in any sort of way. <clears throat> but um, who knows? Maybe Nintendo can win me over with this uh, specific title. Um, I doubt it. I, I'm curious though, since I did that video on like the microtransactions, I wonder if that's going to be something that comes up in this. Um, we'll have to see. It's also curious that they did an Animal Crossing Direct, considering it's the only game we know of that's coming this year for the Switch. I mean, there's Xenoblade Chronicles, but I might be wrong, but I don't think that has a release date that we know of. Ah, Direct's just starting. I'll just shut up and watch this now, but, um... Greetings everyone watching Animal Crossing New Horizons Direct. I'm so very glad to welcome you all to this information session. Our long way to Desert Island Gear Effect. I do kind of wish we were getting a normal Direct just to give us more games that we were hoping to see this year, but... The only game we know that's coming this year is what's getting the Direct, so... I guess we'll just have to suck it up anyway. A refresh on our gateway package, a reminder of what we shared so far. Part 2 will cover future development plans, and Part 2 will answer some frequently asked questions. So, is Part 2 gonna be about like DLC and stuff or something? <clears throat> okay, here we go. Like I said, I have no experience with Animal Crossing, so I'm probably not gonna have much of a reaction to this. I'll stop now. It has a very nice graphical look, I will say. Especially during the daytime. Nook Inc. presents. You know, at this point, I've only ever seen, like, Tom Nook on the, well, the small bits of advertising they've done, so, like, is Isabel in this? Correct me if I'm wrong, I haven't seen her, I don't think. Trailer. 
trees look really nice. The um, contrast between the green and the pink. I mean, the, se the season change looks really. Ooh, the fall looks really nice. I believe so far this is just a loose no. I believe this is just a refresher so far because we've seen this before um, E3 and the last Nintendo Direct I believe. So this kind of information is just recapping what we already know before they get into the real meat of things. Mm -hmm. New resident orientation. For a split second, I thought that was Yoshi. So what the hell is going on in the chat? Everyone's just asking like Pokemon and like Smash. Have they have they forgotten this is literally as it says? Just an animal crossing Nintendo Direct. Tour facilities. I hope this isn't too boring for you guys because like I said, I have no experience with this, so this isn't gonna like wow me or impress me in any major way. So I'll be, I will be fairly blank faced for most of it. So I apologize if that um, is like a major turn off for you. But I decided to watch it anyway because it's a Nintendo Direct and it gives something to talk about. Why would you live in a deserted island? Remember when crafting was meant to be a thing in Breath of the Wild? First, I do. Simple DIY workbench. The best thing I love doing is just I believe it was at E3 they showed you could dig up a tree with a shovel. <clears throat> Completely stupid, but it's funny. If I didn't get the game, that's probably all I would be doing. Because those are obviously real life skills. Maybe it's just me, but it, it looks like that island's gonna get pretty cramped pretty quickly. Mm. I don't know. It's quite the, um, quite the airport. quickly graze over the fact that there's only one island per system. Okay, the picture thing's actually pretty nice. I can see this getting so like uh, implementing for like trolls it's going to be like the ultimate way to troll someone with this like message board thing
that it could provide you with food, but, you know, why would that? I'm surprised Nintendo don't make this as an actual um, real product, like just for like exclusive to the game or something. Who knows? Again, I apologize if I'm like, if this is boring to you, like my reaction to it, since I'm pretty much gonna have the same straight face for the entire thing as I've said already. <clears throat> but hey, who knows? Maybe there'll be something that comes up that'll catch my attention. Because like so far for me personally, since I'm not a fan of the series or I don't really care that much for Animal Crossing, I'm seeing all this and I'm just like, yeah, whatever, like, you know. But I'm interested to see like how this is going to change the opinion of people who are um, skeptical of this game because Obviously, this game had a lot of controversy around it. Obviously, the microtransactions, <coughs> the save cloud features, things like this. So it'll be interesting to see how Animal Crossing fans react after after this. It's dangerous to go alone. Take this. Oh, you can actually die. You can actually die. Okay. That, that's actually interesting. You can you can actually die. Okay. I don't know. Maybe that was a thing in other games, but that's that's funny. Did you know night time gets dark? I personally didn't know that at all. Is that a boo? <laughs> I'm going to assume this is a character from other Animal Crossing games. But it's an island. Literally to open your eyes, kids. Trip so far. For a price. Yeah, because I'm sure Tom Nook's not going to come to your house in five months' time with a gun demanding his money. This, I'm aware, is a thing that other Animal Crossing games have had. 
if not every game. I would say the actual like character models and stuff actually do look kind of cute. Then again, they always kind of have, so that's nothing new. Love how his eyes got bigger. Then he was like, "It could be bigger." Optional extra two. Other islands? Oh. Shoveling trees, yes! Oh, I thought it was just a single island. Maybe they changed that. Maggie. <laughs> you read that as mango first. I mean, it certainly seems that so far there's a lot of um, content to keep Animal Crossing fans happy. Uh, I don't know if it's as much or more than previous games have been, so, you know, you can all let me know down below what, um, what that's like. It'd be great if you could be like hide and seek or something. Three option extras. That's actually pretty amazing. I mean, you need to switch online, but still, that's a pretty cool thing. It's not an actual Animal Crossing smartphone, but it's, you know, it's pretty much close to what that would have been. pretty cool. I mean, it's a bit like Amiibo features. Except that, like, Amiibos are kind of, you know, dead at the moment, sadly. I don't know if they'll make ami Amiibos for this game. Because this app seems like it's kind of taking the, um, the place of that. Is there on developments? Okay, so this might be, like, DLC and stuff. Some residents yourself. 
Okay. Nook's cranny. <laughs> that's funny. Ooh, that's actually really nice. Oh, okay, that's actually really nicely done, the graphics on that aquarium. Because there's a lot of furniture there, yeah. Is that meant to be, like, um... I can't think of just that anime girl with famous light blue hair. Is it... Mikasa or something? I, I probably said that wrong, so I'm, I'm not going to take a guess at it. CEO's got some uh, dodgy um, mates. So this direct is nearly over anyway. I'm about 18 minutes into it. Hey, of course she's in it. Is that a new outfit or something? I'll have to see what the chat is thinking of this. Chat is freaking out over this, as you would imagine. She'd quite the um, graphical update on her. Like the detail and stuff is more apparent in her design. Easter, Halloween, Christmas. Not for me, to be honest, not for me. That looks kind of awkward, to be honest. Maybe that's just me, but I don't know. Trying to get like the precision on that looks a bit. Just damn the river, yeah. That is one strong builder. You know, it would be really nice. I had like the end day announced like a real Nintendo Direct. Not to sound like I'm bashing this, but like it'd be cool if at the end they were like, oh yeah, tune in in like next week. They won't, but I'm just saying that would be really cool if they did. Ah, 
Happy birthday. That will make for a nice screenshot. There's still about three minutes left, so are we gonna get something else? Probably do like some shock reveal now or something. Thank you all for your invited attention. I think you have a good picture of the getaway package, hmm? I'm sure some of you have already decided to make the move. Others might still be thinking it over. I hope all of you use this time until our getaway package flight begins to imagine what your life would be like. Finally, I'm sure many of you still have questions, hmm? We've anticipated some specific ones. This is where they... My task combined these into a FAQ segment for part one. Let's take a look. Isabel's outfit changed. It's actually really satisfying topping the amiibos on the joystick. <laughs> oh, she's random placement of objects just there. Ah, oh, yes, the important one. Animal Crossing New Horizons does not support the same data cloud feature. However, we're planning to offer a service for recovering backed up save data from the server in certain circumstances, such as console damage or loss. Will there be a special theme system to go along with the game? Yes, a special oh, Animal Crossing theme That switch looks absolutely gorgeous. Look at those joy cons. They're so nice. Seems really happy about it. Bonnie Day. Once again, thanks very much for attending our information session. Just one final tidbit. After this presentation, I start sharing directly with one dessert and the official animal archive. Yes, yes, I'd certainly appreciate a follow. I look very much forward to meeting you all in the island of March 20. Lovely new horizon awaits us all. Isabel. 
Yep, that looks like it's it. And they have the Amiibo support card in the back. Oh, and it has an official logo now, actually. That's that's new. So, yeah, that... I think that... Yep, that's it. Well, then, um... What did I think, to wrap this up pretty quickly? Um, you know, Animal Crossing is not for me, as I've said numerous times, but... You know, it doesn't mean I have anything against it. it. It looks pretty cool for those who are interested. I can definitely see like the Animal Crossing type appeal in it. And um, you know, if you're interested in this kind of thing, obviously this is going to be a big appeal to you. From what I can tell, the Animal Crossing fan base seems pretty happy with what they've seen. So um, I'm happy for them and um, I'm happy for you if any of you guys are a fan of the series. Um, but yeah, let me know down in the comment section below what did you all think. Did you like this Nintendo Direct? Um, will you be getting the game? And what do you think of all these different features? Um, and what do you think they might add in future updates or something? So yeah, thank you all for watching and um, please subscribe. I apologise one last time if it was boring. I know it probably wasn't that enjoyable, but you know, I said I'd do it anyway. Because it's probably the only Direct we're getting this year. Um, so yeah, thank you all for watching and um, please subscribe. Nova Scorpius out.